It's super crunchy. It's also been described as dusty. Dusty? Yeah. Well, I'll take a little dust now and then. So, what do we do? Toast? Toast. All right. And let's talk about Cheers. it. Cheers. Here we go. If you've seen my previous videos, you know Cambodia has some amazingly good food, but they also have some of the world's most intimidating food. Therefore, tonight, I will get over my fear of insects for good by, uh, by eating them. I'm going to eat the insects. Bug tour. Oh, okay. Today, I'm in Siem Reap, Cambodia. Every year, tons of people come here to eat bugs. There's also something about a temple. The temple is not a temple. There's a temple. Yeah, the temple. I'm not very religious. I just came here to eat bugs. No, no move. I'm your friend. I do not fear you, therefore you should not fear me. We are brothers. We are one and the same, though I will eat your cousins in about... Oh my god, okay, we're, I'm done. Do you know Tarantula, the big spider? Oh, over there. Yeah. Nice. You like that one? Yes, I like to. Uh, what is the best way to eat tarantula? Do you have it like braised or do you kind of like fry it? Well, how do you eat the tarantula? After a long day of temple hopping, a lot of travelers end up here, Pub Street, a place that has nothing to do with culture and everything to do with getting wasted and daring your friends to eat something terrifying. It is no coincidence that all the bug stalls on Pub Street are located right next to all the alcohol stalls. Obviously, people are getting wasted and then they're daring their frat boy brothers to uh, indulge in some of the local uh, cuisine here. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's do scorpion. If you do eat this in front of a girl, she will find you uh, actually more uh, repulsive. Yeah, she won't <laughs> like it. For just a dollar each, there are just so many yummy treats to choose from. They have grasshoppers, frog, crickets, scorpions, snake. I've had all of it, no big deal. Very easy, especially for someone like me. But I've never had the tarantula. Pub Street does have plenty of yummy food too, but I'm here to take on the king of creepy crawlers, the eight-legged nightmare, the fried tarantula. It has three distinct flavors. It has the leg flavor, the head flavor, and the body flavor. Uh, and I'm really looking forward to, uh, to, to, uh, to trying it. Here's a dollar. Fun. But before I eat this tarantula, I need a little appetizer. So I'm heading just down the street to Bugs Cafe. It, we can get a hot coconut curry, green or Mediterranean. Comment now on which you would like me to eat. I'll wait. Okay, people voted for coconut curry. Good choice, guys. Bugs Cafe is the first insect tapas restaurant in Cambodia ever, and maybe the only one. Uh, there are uh, just a couple flies flying around. Now, are those flies or are those ingredients? It's the fly, it's not ingredient. Oh. Eating bugs is not really considered taboo in Cambodia, and for some, it's a common snack. As a child, did you actually eat some kinds of insects, and then what kinds did you? Um, all kinds of insects. Okay. All kinds. So I used to eat um, cricket, I used to eat um, tarantula, I used to eat scorpion, I used to eat um, many different insects. Today I'm trying their discovery platter, complete with wild spring rolls, an ant puff pastry, sautéed crickets and silkworms, coconut curry topped with bee larvae, and one insect skewer. Oh god, that beetle. Oh, it's a water bug. It's really big. Yummy. I'm gonna go in order from least to most terrifying. Of course. Oh, it's got huge eyeballs. It can, it's still, it's looking at me. Most of the items tasted great. In fact, you couldn't even tell they contained bugs at all. It really tastes kind of like a garlic bread nice. with some ants on it. And really, even if you're eating garlic bread and you drop it and it collects some ants on accident, you still eat it. It's garlic bread. This is crazy. This is called a vegetable. Not bad. And this is like silkworm pupa. This one is silkworm. Now, the only time I've ever had silkworm pupa was in Korea. And it tasted like something that had, like a, an old mattress had been boiled for five hours. It was not in my top 10. <sighs> oh my God. I'm gonna give it another chance. I think that was all about the preparation. Oh. Oh. Three of them. It 
It's still a little bit mattressy, but like 5%. It has a nice crunch. All these little guys are but an appetizer, leading up to this evil looking monstrosity. Okay, do you think I should just do one bite? You can do one bite, it's better. Yo, look, like this video. Like this video, subscribe, tell your mom. It's a lot of chewing. It's like a bunch of rice paper. I'm gonna wash it down with some soup. Wow. You know what? Very nice. Then it had almost like a, a little bit of a sweet teriyaki flavor. The only thing that was difficult is it felt like you were eating like five layers of rice paper and it's like you couldn't, you had to, you had to wash it down with something, like a soup. <laughs> you were very brave and wonderful so you can try this kind of thing. Hey, I like you a lot. I'm brave and wonderful. So a lot of people that try, you know, they just eat it bit by bit, bit by bit, so it says nothing. That doesn't get likes on YouTube, you know. I, I do this for the likes. All right, take care. I'm gonna go eat some tar uh, tarantulas now. Here you can see I've got the tarantula. Uh, normal tarantula, eight legs, uh, head, body. All right, um, it's a leg, no big deal, no problem. Um, they're furry. This is like the girl on the swim team who hasn't shaved her legs all semester. If it was up to me, I would want an assortment of uh, dipping sauces, but that's not gonna happen today. This is huge. This is a full meal. So now I'm gonna eat the head. Now I can't remember, I think he said the head had a uh, white meat flavor. We'll find out. I like it, I like it, I like it, I like it, I like it. Now, this is not really, um, the body, it's the ass of the spider. Now, what is in the ass? Well, probably the web material is in there. Guts, eggs maybe? There could be a lot of stuff in there, we're not sure. But we know that it's packed with a bit of protein. Uh, okay, you know what, after I do this, then that's it. I'm done, I've done every bug. This is the last thing, here we go. Good, good, it's okay. Everything's okay. It is not empty. It is full of stuff. Okay. Look, I cheated, I washed it down with beer, I don't care. Done. It has a dusty flavor. Actually, the inside of the tarantula ass is very similar to the scorpion. It's just that there's so much of it. And the scorpion is very airy. Uh, oh, tarantula burp. But the tarantula, it is full of stuff. Uh, well, probably other bugs, because it eats other bugs, but who knows for sure. Okay, guys, I have now eaten every bug. I don't think there's anything left for me to eat. If you can think of a bug I haven't eaten, leave it in the comments, but I think I'm done. Okay, I think today, I think this is it, so. Yeah. Okay, peace. Cut. Tarantula, so good, am I right? Well anyways, don't forget to unsubscribe and dislike this video. Also, I'm headed to Hoi An uh, in a week or so. Let me know if you have any activity or food suggestions there. As always, what's up from Vietnam? We'll see you next week, uh, peace. Is this video 10 minutes yet? Hold on, wait for it, wait for it. Uh, good.